What up guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to my channel. Today I just have a really quick um, sticker haul for you from the Sticker Alley, Peaceful Mind Design and Caitlin & Co Designs. I wanted to do this one in a separate video but I didn't see the point of doing just a small haul for these two. I thought I'd just chuck it in together. So I have my order from Peaceful Mind Design, a grab bag from the Sticker Alley and the March Mystery Kit from Caitlin & Co Designs. So we'll do this one last. First up was my um, grab bag order from the Sticker Alley. They just sent me their business card, um, bookmark stickers planning, stickeralley.etsy.com, Instagram, and their email. It's run by two, I think they're just friends, they could be sisters, but it's Jess and Kim. Um, yeah, I love their business card too, it's really cute. So then in the grab bag, I got one, two, three, four four, five, six sheets. So the first one is this one here. This is a Harry Potter um, kit. These ones are checklists. This is in the Gryffindor colours. I'm pretty sure the other set that they do is either Ravenclaw or Slytherin. I can't remember. But it's got some headers, some checklists, some full box checklists, two Deathly Hallowed symbols and two glasses. And this one is on their matte paper, which is all right. This one, it just got cut a little bit too far through. Then I got these character stickers, and I'm not sure what's wrong with them, but their character stickers don't usually come on sheets this small. So I'm not sure what the go is with this. Um, I actually don't know who they are, though. So if you know who these characters are, let me know in the comments below. I probably will give this away because I don't know... Yeah, I don't know who they are. I want to say it's Game of Thrones because I feel like this is someone called like Khaleesi or something. But I, do, I don't know if I made that up. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so if you know who they are, let me know in the comments below. And then I got this Easter set. Um, and it's just got two Happy Easters, four little chickens. I did peel this one up to see if there was like a peeling problem. I don't know what the problem with this one was. Um, 12 Easter eggs and then some little bunnies down the bottom as well. I honestly don't know what the drama is with this sheet. It's, it seems to be, actually it's just slightly off cut. Like, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't affect the sticker. Um, but it's like the eggs aren't centered in the cut lines. Then I got this tea time set, which is really cute. Um, I'm excited to use it, actually. I didn't think I'd want to do, like, a tea spread because it's a little bit girly, but I do quite like this. I don't know what's wrong with this either. It didn't really cut through anywhere. But I don't see any problems with the cut lines. I don't know. Yeah, don't know, but it's really cute as well. Then I got these book stickers. These will be nice for, like, my study sessions at uni and stuff just all in different colours. Again, don't know what's wrong with these. Uh, yeah, so a couple of just, actually I think it's just that one. Oh no, there's a couple that are like sort of cut through. And then the last sheet I got from the sticker alley was this one with like Marvel and like Avengers and stuff. And you can definitely see what's wrong with this sheet. It was the off cut from when they tried to cut out the whole sheet. Oh, excuse me. Um, but yeah. I've got those as well. So that's my grab bag from the Sticker Alley. Pretty fun. I mean, like, I got a good variety of stickers, so I'm okay with that. Next up is my order from Peaceful Mind Design. Um, this I got to use in my horizontal planner mostly. Um, so hers do ship in these little plastic baggies. So this is the sampler that I got. It's for Easter. Let me just focus you on that. Um, so it's a little owl with a planner, a little chicken with a with a piece of, like I think the stickers, and then the bunny with stickers, and then just this tiny little, oh sorry, tiny little strip here, and this tiny little happy Easter here. I actually love the detail of this. I don't know if my camera is going to focus enough, but you can actually see like the stickers that the the rabbit is holding. Like, there's actually details on the stickers, which is insane. Um, and I love that. So, yeah. Anyway, I got two sets of the horizontal dividers. Um, I got these in the, the darker ones and the lighter ones. They're just really thin, like the divider strips for the um, horizontal planner. 
So I got both of those and it's January through to December as well, which is nice. And then I got these labels, which you guys know I love. Um, so I got three sheets of this color scheme, which is this one. I think this is color scheme two. And then I got three of color scheme one. Which this has been redone because these are all new and I kind of like them. And then I got three in her pastels range as well. So yeah, that's my order from Peace on My Design. I really like that. Now moving on to my March mystery kit from Caitlin & Co. It was shipped in a pink bubble mailer. I just have my address covered and then I'm just going to cover Caitlin's on the back here. But you won't really see that. And this, it, this icon here and then this one here are just like sneak peeks of what's in the pack. So let's just go ahead and open it up. And I have gone through this already. So first up you do get this note here which says, Thank you for ordering the March Mystery Kit. I would just like to let you know that I am so grateful for you ordering the very first Mystery Kit from Caitlin & Co Designs. I hope you love this kit as much as I do. I have loved creating this kit so much that I am now starting up a monthly subscription box. You can be one of the first to subscribe in March by going to CaitlinAndCoMonthly.com. Don't forget to share your March box with me on social media by tagging hashtag CaitlinAndCoMysteryMarch. I can't wait to see how you all you use all your stickers and paperclip from Pocket Life Marks. Love, Caitlin. Now, you guys know that Caitlin is a friend of mine, um, so of course I was going to pick this kit up. This is newly format formatted from her previous kit designs, and this is how I'm pretty sure a lot of her kits are going to come, similarly to this. Um, this website, I'm filming this uh, on the 27th of February, so this website currently does not work. This video, by the time you guys will see it though, will actually be up in March, so I'm hoping that maybe um, you guys will get to um, see it, and if it is... <sighs> Sorry, I don't know why I'm so tired today. Um, if it is an active website, I will link it below. Now, this is the pack of stickers that I did get from Caitlin. This is the order. And then Pocket Life Marks has included a paper clip. So, pull this out. And it's just a basic ribbon paper clip. The colours are absolutely beautiful. And then on the back, it's just sealed with a hot glue dot and a star. Now, I've never ordered from Pocket Life Marks before, and I, I love this paper clip. However, if I was to make it, I would want them to be a little bit shorter, so maybe cut off an inch or so. And it's very, very loosely done, and I don't really like a loose paper clip. I would much prefer these to be pulled much, much tighter. Um, and maybe even a slightly bigger paper clip too would be nice. But that's just me personally. Um, these are actually really, really gorgeous, and I know Pocket Life Marks is quite um quite popular so yeah i'm excited to use this one and it just has on the back here um pocket life marks so etsy and at pocket life marks on instagram i will link her below as well then we get into the stickers now caitlin did also can include a small washi tape sample and i watched natalie's video in versus scribbles um and she got a yellow one and i received a pink and green chevron tape um which i do enjoy and i think goes better with this kit than the than a yellow one would that's just my opinion personally um, and I'm excited that I, I got one. I love washi, as you guys know. So, yep, got that. I think that was just something that Caitlin did. So then going into the pack of stickers. Um, so you do get her business card as per usual. Details on the back. She will be linked down below though, so like, that's irrelevant. And then you get nine sheets of stickers. So I'm just going to zoom you down in just a touch. So the first one is this um, functional sheet and you get a Hello Weekend banner, which is I think her new format for her weekend banners. Then you get this quote box here, um, which says, let us be grateful to people who make us happy. They are charming gardeners who make our souls blossom. I don't know if that's focusing. There you go. 
Um, so that's really pretty. And then you get um, a payday, a day off, and a build you decorative flag, and then three blank decorative flags here as well. And then you get all of these icons and all of these um, heart checklists. So you get four, eight, eleven checklists, and then in the icons there is a camera, a shopping cart, a nail polish, wine, an airplane, a dollar sign, a car, a bed, Etsy, an envelope, cleaning icon, asterisk, balloons, a knife and fork, piggy bank, TV, a house, eyebrow and eyelashes, um, a laptop, a vacuum, scales, swimming, a filming slate and a present. So that's really, really cute. Oh, and that was so blurry that whole time. I'm sorry. Let me just show you a little bit closer up. So the next one is this decorative sheet, which is absolutely beautiful. I am not a floral planner in any sense. I do not like super girly spreads. I don't like florally spreads. It's not what I'm into. This reminds me of, like, old women. No offense to any old women, but I just, I, it's not my style. But this is just beautiful. I'm so excited to plan with it. So that's the decorative sheet. These are the full boxes. I absolutely love it. The next sheet is this one which contains some half boxes and some appointment label size boxes like quarter boxes. And you get pink, orange, yellow and green which is the colour scheme that she's gone with for this kit. And then the heart, ombre heart checklist, so two green, two yellow, two orange, two pink. I also don't use these, but I'm actually excited. Now that I've actually got some that are in a kit, I'm excited to give them a try. Then you get your headers. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. Um, so you get tiny tasks to do and today. And then you get to go, to buy, to clean, remember, important, at home, at work, at school, nope, not today, hashtag adulting, and yes. I like these, but I like, you get, so two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, you get twelve, like, what am I going to do with the other five, you know? Um, I wish there was, was just seven and, like, this was utilized for something else, but I do like them. Next up are the little things, and you get twelve dinners, 12 TVs, 12 asterisk, and then you get um, a post, like a mailbox, a spray bottle, two scales, a lap two laptops, two books, two piggy banks, and two balloons. Again, what am I going to do with like the extras of these? I would prefer like seven um, meal plan ones, maybe seven TVs as well, and then like I'd prefer to have like seven cleaning ones. You only need two scales, and like a few other little random ones would be nice to chuck in as well. But, I mean, it's not my kit. And I do I do like that there are so many TVs and so many asterisks because I will use these. I'm just really bummed about the cleaning ones because I'm going to have to try and find um, a pink that or like a colour that's going to match that I can use because I use those every day. Next up is the washi sheet. So you get solid pink, solid green, solid yellow, and then you get a solid floral as well. And by the looks of things, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different sizes of washi strips on this. So that's really good. And then the last page is this flag set, which I like, but I wish that it was like half flags, half teardrops or something like that. Just because I feel like this many flags is so much for one kit, but I like it. I do like it. It's very pretty. So yeah. I'll zoom you guys back out a little. Woo. See my rubbish everywhere. So yeah, that's the mystery kit. I, as I said, I'm not a floral planner, but like this just, I don't know, it just, it just does something to me. I, <laughs> I don't know. I, I really I am kind of sold on it. I really like it. Um, it is super duper pretty. I'm excited to uh, play around and have a plan with it and stuff. And then, as I said before, like my piece of my design order is here. Also, I will link all of these shops down below for you guys to check out um, if you're interested. I don't think any of these shops 
currently have um, coupon codes. And I know that Caitlin & Co. is actually closed at the moment. So that's a bit of a bummer. Like, especially if you're looking to order, I am sorry that she's closed. Um, I've said this in a couple videos, actually, though. If anyone was needing to contact her, I am actually the person to contact. Um, and I will pass on any messages to her that need to be passed on. Just because, um, yeah, she's she's just not taking anything right now. But yeah, anyway, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give me a thumbs up and let me know down below. Um, what stickers are your favourite? And if you know who these characters are. If you ordered the month, March Monthly, oh my god. If you guys ordered the March Monthly, let me know what your plans for it are. I'm actually literally about to start planning my plan with me um, for it. I wanted to use, where is it? This kit from Caitlin & Co. It's like mint marble or something or other um, next week, but I'm too sold on this one. I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna I'm gonna sacrifice. So yeah, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Let me know down below who these characters are, and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye.